Okay, folks, another little project here we're doing this week. And uh, we decided we're going to make a magnetic lift for our steel when it shows up to the door. Instead of using the forks to lift the steel down and damaging the steel, probably scratching it and whatnot, we decided to use these magnets. So we had to make a, uh, a module for it to hold them in place. And uh, you're soon going to see if it worked or not. So, let's get to it. The beauty with this is the fact that you can use it on any forklift, and also the magnet holders can uh, frame can be used on a gantry or on a lift or or whatever. So it's got multiple uses. It's um, it's very versatile, and. Uh, I could have, I was going to make some changes to it, but I said, no, before I go too far, I'm going to uh, just leave it like it is and see how it works out. Hopefully, it'll be okay. sheets are usually banded. Yeah. So this is kind of fooling us up a little bit for this little experiment. Yeah. So I don't want you near it. Okay. I'll if back it, away. If it drops, we'll, okay. just, throw, we'll just throw Kathy in under it. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm going to stay right here. Yeah. <laughs>
too. A lot better than using the dollies. Oh my God, yes. I need this for air. Now listen. Absolutely. Elvis was just asking, he said, where'd you get the idea for that? And I said, Kathy's magnetic personality. <laughs> you see that guy right there, folks? The best truck driver, I'm going to say in Newfoundland. Whoa. He, he, sure, he, great. sure, he delivered, he delivered a metal break sure one day, help me out, put it together. Oh, <laughs> yes. Yeah. 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 I did. Yeah. Yes, sir. What a man, brother. What a man. Super cool. Man, oh man. Wow. That was easy peasy. As easy as one yet. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. That was perfect. I'm pretty pleased with that. I say you are. That was the maiden voyage today. Yep, yeah, never tried it before. Always wanted to do it. We cut that out of the bit of scrap we had the other day. That's only quarter, but it can hold a lot of weight. These magnets hold about uh, 1,200 pounds each. I was a little bit concerned about these, but they were, uh, they're supposed to be around 1,000 to 1,200 pounds each. So, well, no trouble. No but trouble. that's the first time we had steel come where the bands were broke. Yeah. Because, you were, yes, that was a surprise. Because uh, they changed trucks. Yes, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, they moved it off one truck onto the other, and then... Yeah. Well, we shall do it this way. Because this can stay in here. Wow, oh, great. Then I'm going to go out and you can shut the garage door for me. So that was well worth the effort, eh? Wow, it was, wasn't it? Yeah. It worked perfect. Yeah, and it's, uh, oh no, I can't do this. I need to take this because I've got to lift the other steel in. Okay. Right? Yeah, we're getting ahead of ourselves. Yeah. We're getting too excited. <laughs> That's yeah. true. Yeah. So. And you're upper management. <laughs> you're supposed to know these things. Oh, yeah? I just put these clamps on to keep it from sliding. But I'm going to make up an adapter to go on here with a twist, mm -hmm. so I don't need to use the clamps anymore. I just, before I got into it too much deeper, I wanted to see if it would actually lift it. Yeah, and work, test right? it out and see what you need to do. You know what I mean, Burr? Yeah, Burr. You know, you know what I mean? Anyway, Elvis has left the building. He has.
Oh yeah. I didn't want to get up to get down. And move it again, so yeah. So now you gotta lock them in, magnetize them, right? Yeah. Okay, so now you're going to take now those Now we're going to put this away. That worked out really go, good, didn't it? it? I'm really pleased with that. That's, uh, that's exceeded my expectations, I can tell you that. I wonder how heavy those magnets are in weight. They're, they're really heavy. I'm going to guess 40 pounds. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now... We got other steel out in the other place, but when we find out the steel is getting a bit low, we like to have extra because living on an island, storms, ice conditions That's right. can hinder your, your uh, metal supply, yeah, even good. your grocery supply. I know. Yeah, yeah and you need uh, something on hand where you don't have to be run in and out in the weather. Now, here's these holes here, by the way. It's made for a shackle or whatever, so you can hang it from a gantry or a hoist. But this is the neat, this is the neat thing right here. Just show you how balanced this is. And there's, it hasn't been balanced other than cutting it right from the plate. Wow. Yeah, look at that. Isn't that amazing? That is amazing. Yeah. Hey, so that little video for for you folks, consider, you know, with the subject matter being steel and tractors. So you guys hope you enjoy it. You guys take care. God bless.